The project, Responsible Governance of Investment in Land, Arigil, is part of the GIZ Global Program, Responsible Land Policy, implemented in Uganda through the country program Responsible Land Policy in Uganda, Relapu, attached to the Ministry of Lands, Housing and Urban Development, funded by the European Union and the German Federal Ministry of Economic Cooperation and Development, BMZ, that aims to ensure that investments in land are productive, contribute to sustainable land management and respect the rights and needs of local populations, particularly vulnerable groups and women. We work with uh, JZ uh, in Mitiana, Mubende and the, uh, Kasanda uh, implementing a project called uh, Responsible Governance of Investments in Land uh, which looks at uh, uh, guaranteeing uh, responsible agriculture investments in land. Through the support of the project, the capacities of key stakeholders including government staff, selected investors as well as civil society and community representatives have been strengthened through the action strategic approach. Uh, a number of activities have been done and this is inclusive of capacity building of investors. They have been able to train the government authorities and a number of the district officials, the sub officials like the CDOs, the DCDOs. The main activities of the project have been capacity building, enabling platforms for engagement, dispute resolution and the promotion of involvement of communities. Capacity development included the production of training materials and training courses focusing on three actor groups, government authorities, investors and local affected communities with their stakeholders and non-government organizations. As far as Argyle is concerned, as a district we're really grateful, one, for the capacity development that has been done. It has tried to harmonize all the actors that are in, involved in the investment. Multi-stakeholder engagements have been organized and many major stakeholders have been equipped with knowledge and skills on how to promote responsible governance of investment in land. As Pelham Uganda, specifically our role in this project is to uh, provide platforms for engagements uh, between the investors and the local communities. This has been done in all the project areas in Mitiana, Mubende, Teso districts and the northern part of the country. Land investors in different communities of the country have been part of this project and many boast of their achievements after getting involved. It has been very helpful because you know sometimes uh, policies are, are made behind the desks and they never get down to the community. But through Agile we've been able to bring um, those things down to the community. Learning might be slow, but you know, you just keep persisting. One other key area this project has focused on is the issue of disputes resolutions. Committees have been established, including local leaders, to manage disputes, and this has created harmony within the communities. Mm -hmm. Some of the challenges that have been faced are regarding uh, the engagement of domestic agribusiness investors who have this far not been guided by both international and national guidelines um, in the acquisition of land, in the caring of the environment, in looking at uh, uh, respecting labor rights and human rights. Um, so they have been challenging to engage in the Argyle project. Involvement of communities was equally strengthened through the project. Women and the elderly have equally gotten their benefit after being involved. A point in case is Chitamilikan Loy, an investor in Mitiana district, has been able to mobilize a community to benefit from her farm. 
she further went ahead to look for markets for the entire community and all this is attributed to the Aragil project. Many members of the community attest to this and they share their experiences. This project, however, is not being implemented in isolation. Many entities, including local government leaders, NGOs, government institutions such as NEMA, Ministry of Lands, and many others have been part of its journey. Well, this project has uh, actually created a great impact in the communities. Uh, previously, the, the, we've been having I investments, but now the key term is responsible investment in land. Responsible governance of investment in land has been running for three years and annual multi-stakeholder dialogues have been organized to review and refocus back on track. With support from GIZ, RELAPU, Ministry of Lands, Housing and Urban Development, Uganda Investment Authority, UIA, National Environment Management Authority, NEMA, District Local Governments, Aragil Partners and Civil Society Organizations working with domestic investors and local land users in Central, Tesson and Lango subregions, these project's activities have contributed successfully to more responsible investments in land. <music> <music>